Hello cruisers, Trent here and today I welcome you to cruise along with me. Today we're going to be going to Tea House located in uh, Minneapolis, Minnesota. It's been around forever. I'm going to be going with Roger. You may remember him from one of my videos. I'll be linking that video down below. But I cannot wait to go get some authentic Chinese food. It should be a very, very fun experience. I cannot wait. I've only ever heard very, very good things about this place. And uh, let's see uh, how authentic this case, uh, this place can be. Now, uh, if you're watching this video, you've probably already seen my update. I'm back on the cruise ship now, but I made this video right before I went back to the ship. So I will see you soon, cruisers. Okay, cruisers, I'm here with Roger. You remember this fine fellow from the video where I interviewed him. We're gonna give that other interview later, later, but Roger, are you excited for Tea House? Of course I am. Let's go in, let's get some food. Let's do it. Okay, Roger and I are gonna get comfortable. We will see you soon, cruisers. I think this place is gonna be great. Roger, what are you thinking? Of course, man. I love everything. Let's see. Okay, cruisers, me and Roger just sat down. Take a look at this menu. This menu is looking amazing. I'm excited. Roger, what are you thinking? I'm excited, man. We are excited, but take a look at this menu and I will see you soon. Okay, we just put in our first order. I got the homemade hot and sour dumpling soup. I got the Szechuan dumplings. Roger, what did you get? I got the fried cheese wontons. The fried cheese wontons? I think this is gonna be pretty badass. Oh yeah, I love my fried cheese wontons. Mm, I love some fried cheese yeah. wontons. I cannot wait to show you this food once it comes out. See you soon. Okay, so I know you said this is authentic, um, but as spicy as possible, yes. let's do that cu um, couple's beef slices. And again, I want you to make me cry really mess me up. I mean, that makes me cry every time. <laughs> I know, but I, I'm crazy. <laughs> okay. Like, you know, make, like, your goal should be to make me not be able to eat it. Definitely, yeah, that would be the goal. Perfect, and then let's do those uh, soup dumplings. And then Roger? And then can I get the tiger pork? I'm excited. Okay, I'll get this one for you. Well, thank you. At the end, are you okay being interviewed for a minute? Will you be okay with that? If not, it's okay. No. Okay. She does not want to be interviewed. Not everyone does. Roger does. He's a he's a face for video. Show them they're probably whites. But I cannot wait. Uh, Roger, you think this is gonna be spicy? For you, yes. Maybe for me also. I don't like spice. You don't. You don't like spice. I don't like spice. I, I like when it's mild. You're a disappointment, sir. I don't like spice. Do you remember that Thai restaurant? <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> we'll link that video down below. He... Yes, uh, he remembers the Thai restaurant. Yep. <laughs> well, we'll see you when the food starts coming out. See you soon, cruisers. Okay, cruisers, the first dishes just came out. We have his food, we have my food. It's looking great, what are you thinking? I'm excited, man. I'm excited, but take a look at this, take a look. Okay, let's go in. Not as sweet. That's all I like This is honestly some of the best hot and sour soup I've had in my life. Why? It's unbelievable. My wonton is not as sweet. You like sweet wontons? I like it a little bit sweet. But there is a sauce, there is a difference for it. You need that dip. I'm not carrying 
Sauce. Tastes all like ketchup. Ketchup? Tastes a lot like ketchup. Five red, more like a... Seven? Six? Six point five? Out of ten? I don't know. I rate this uh, hot and sour soup like almost some of the best of my life. Uh huh? Have you tried hot and sour soup? Nope. You want to take a little spoonful? I love to. Want to try the wonton? I'd love to try a wonton here. Just let some. Um, pour some. Yeah, just pour some in there. Let's try one of these wontons. I'll see if I know what you're talking about. I can see what you're talking about. It's not my favorite. Uh, Wonton ever. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's good, but it's not amazing. Yeah, it's not amazing. It's like this is something good to start with. It doesn't blow your mind, but no, um, I think this is gonna blow your mind though. Just the broth alone is very flavorful. It is. Mhm. Mm Tastes like both. Yeah, it does. Tastes like both. Oh, this is spicy. This is a little kick to it. It has a little kick. It has a little kick. What do you think? Better than the wontons? The dumpling's great. Mm -hmm. It's better than the wontons. Let's try one of these dumplings to see how good. the dumplings are good. Mm -hmm. That's great. Thank you. Are these the soup dumplings you think? Yep, these are trip. Those are trip. Okay, we just have something else come out. Take a look at these. These are looking pretty phenomenal. Raj, you'll try one of these, right? Oh. Okay, take a look. I'm like these appetizers so far. Um, they're great. They're great. Yeah. I'm gonna try some of the shrimp real quick. Yeah, try some of that. Let me know what you think. I'm gonna keep a drink for my hot and sour soup. It's different. It's good. It's great. It's a lot more sweet. More sweet? More sweet. Okay, Roger, let's try some of this. Okay, let's try. I believe these are the soup dumplings. Mm -hmm. Oh. Those are good. Mm. I think those are the best thing yet. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Wow. But let's enjoy this food and we'll talk the most the next dish comes out. Of course. Let's do it. The food is tasting spicy. These soup dumplings are, I think, my favorite part of the appetizers. What's your favorite appetizer, you think? I like these. The soup dumplings? The soup dumplings? Everything is perfect. Those soup dumplings. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Was that a lot of spice for you? For me, yeah. For you, yeah. All right, I'll take this away. This one should be coming shortly. Thank you. Thank you. Again, everything is perfect. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. The service here is amazing. The food is amazing. I think my least favorite appetizer, and it's not bad, are probably the cream Wonton. cheese, the wontons, the cream yep. cheese puffs. Yep. But, uh, again, they're not bad. It's just everything else is so authentic and so uh, great that I probably wouldn't get these again. Yeah. Like, for me, if I'm getting these, I'd rather just make them myself. Mm -hmm. It's cheaper, and I get to make it the way I like it. How do you like it? A little bit sweeter? I like it a bit sweeter. Okay. The cream cheese, like it when the cream cheese is a bit sweeter. When you just put a little bit of sugar in it. Just make it a sweeter. And then the sauce, it just tastes more like ketchup. Where I'd rather just use ketchup than use a sauce. Because if it's gonna taste like ketchup, I might as well use ketchup. Yeah, you'd prefer more of the sweet and kind of tangy yeah. sauce that's more authentic? Yeah. Oh, I agree. I think they honestly have these on the menu for more of the traditional uh, people that don't want that authentic taste. Yeah, yeah. I can agree on that one. Yeah, so I think these are, you know, for the people that don't want to be experimental. And uh, they're safe. There's nothing bad with them, but I could go to Panda Express and I'd probably get just as good of a yeah. Yeah. cream cheese puff. Yeah.
Roger, I'd be honored if you got this last one. I'm gonna have one more cheese. She's gonna have the last one of those. I'm gonna have one more cream cheese puff, and then uh, we'll wait for our main dish to come, and we'll go from there. Huh? Well, Roger, you are really right about these. They're not. Uh, they're not spectacular. Mm -hmm. They're. They're good. They're a good start for kids. <laughs> they're a great start for kids. That's a nice way of wording it. Yeah. <laughs> great start for kids. It's not bland, but it's like it's flavored. <laughs> but as a kid. I don't like it because a lot of kids they like ketchup. So the sauce, it's very with sauce. You really hung up with that ketchup. You really don't like that sauce. I don't like it. No. It just tastes much like ketchup. <laughs> okay. But cruisers, we will see you soon once our main course comes out. I'm excited. Uh, what did you order for your main? Charger pork. Okay, I ordered the like doubles pork. It's like a cold, authentic Chinese dish. Um, she said I may not like it, but you know, I like authentic. I'm not playing. I'm not basic. We will see, but see you soon. So before, those were actually the Szechuan dumplings, not the soup dumplings. Me and Roger were very wrong. These are going to be the soup dumplings in here, but uh, the Szechuan dumplings are amazing. Don't you agree? They're amazing. Do you think the soup dumplings are going to be better? I feel like the soup dumpling is going to be more bland, more traditional. Mm-hmm. Like easier way to make it because you don't have to put all the flavor in it. It's just kind of you make the dumpling, you put it in a steamer or you boil it until it's cooked and you just eat it. Well, we'll see, but cruisers, take a look at this food. Take a look. Okay, Roger. Should we go in for our first bites? Let's do it. Do you want to start off with the soup dumplings? Um, I'll be honored to serve you. Okay, let's both have one. Let's see how it is. Have you had a soup dumpling before? I had it in a soup. Like a chicken soup dumpling. Ooh, they're soupy. Okay. Can we use it as a spoon? So I heard you take a little bite and then you drink the soup out of it. Sometimes. Like It's clean. It's clean. It's clean. You know, it doesn't have that kick that the um, Szechuan dumplings had, but it's good. Mm. Do you see what I'm talking about? Yeah. It tastes like a homemade. It tastes homemade. It tastes homemade. It's uh, yeah. it's a very clean feel to it. Doesn't mm -hmm. taste processed. Thank you very much. Oh, yes, please. Thank you. Is that spicy enough? Uh, I'm about to try it right now. I'll let you know. That's good. That's good? Mm -hmm. right. If you need anything else, let me know. But there's a call service in the back. You can do the menu. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. So they have a little call service button, so you can kind of click it if you need help. Like click, click. But um, it's it's good. It's flavorful. Roger, what are you thinking of yours? I'm like to try it. If I pork, I'm gonna try a piece of mine. Yeah. Let's try. Let's, let's do Switch. some switches. Okay, let's try Rogers. Oh. Wow. I'm impressed with both dishes. They're very different. Rogers is pan fried, has a really nice crisp to it. And mine is more uh, cold and inviting. Uh, I like how it's cold so the peppers really don't burn your mouth, but to still get that heat from the seasoning. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Which one do you like better, you think? I like mine better. But the spice doesn't kick in right away, which like it takes a while and it builds up. Definitely. Yeah. But gold both amazing dishes. Mm -hmm. Mm 
You gotta eat a rice, man. You need some rice, you're right. Rice is power. Oh. Rice is everything. Rice is everything. <laughs> Do you think you'd come back here? Are you impressed? Oh yeah, I'll come back here. Come back here instantly. I'll come back here. This food is authentic. It's great. Um, it's not fake at all. The soup dumpling is dripping. I'm dripping. Roger, are you dripping? That's why I use a spoon. That's why I use a spoon. <laughs> But I honestly think this is one of the most authentic uh, Chinese restaurants I've been to here in Minneapolis. Yeah, similar. I think one of my favorite things was the Szechuan dumplings. Oh, those are amazing. Those, those are amazing. amazing. Those Do you mind if I steal another piece of yours? Golfer. Golfer. I honestly think Tea House here in Minneapolis, Minnesota has some unbelievable food. The service is top notch. It's as authentic as can be. I have really no complaints other than uh, the cream cheese wontons being a little too uh, Chinese American. Yeah, yeah, uh, it's more like Panda Express. Yeah. 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 They just didn't shout to me. They weren't um, outstanding, but everything else I've had has been pretty great. Yeah. What if the authentic way, the traditional way, is like this? But I've had an express and I can twist it up to make it more sweet for Americans. Are cream cheese wontons authentic at all? I don't know. I mean, I feel, I I feel, like, I feel like those were just always... Uh, I feel like yeah, yeah, American people, they like fried food. Fried and, food. Hey, let's just fry it. And then next thing you know, fried long time. But yours is fried, and yours is a... Uh, Not me. It's great. It's pretty yeah. great. Yeah, you already did that. Spices are not. No, it's not, but um, it's welcoming. I really like it. Yeah. It's like... More spicy than mild, but it's not hot. It doesn't burn your mouth right away. No, it tastes clean too. No. You don't taste the spice. It was just slowly build up in your mouth mm -hmm. while you're chewing. Mm -hmm. I agree. I think this made me beef stomach. The more I eat this, I think it made me beef stomach. I mean, see that texture right there? Mm -hmm. That is not a normal beef. Well, these right here is normal beef. That's normal beef. This one here? Mm-hmm. Well, that's normal beef. That's normal beef. Mm-hmm. I'm getting full though. What are you? I'm getting full. Mm -hmm. This is my first meal of the day. <laughs> It's perfect. Are you feeling the spice or no? Uh, not really, not but... Not really? Oh my god, this is super spicy for me. Really? Yeah, this, well, I guess I can... Uh, but I'm crazy, I mean, he can tell you. Yeah. Like, when it comes to spices, uh, I'm I'm dumb. The, okay, that's the spiciest thing that I know in the menu. So really? So, is this yeah. just beef slices or also beef stomach? A stomach. A stomach, that's like what I belly, thought. The, the belly, pork belly? Yes, pork. Yeah. Okay, that's what I thought. Yeah. No, it's delicious. Thank you. You liking this so far? I'm loving it. Right, you loving yours? I'm loving it. Okay. Thank you. So I was right. This is just not beef uh, cuts. It's also beef stomach. That's probably why she warned me in the beginning that I may not like it. But I'm enjoying it. It's good. It's clean. Mm -hmm. I've been through it. You're loving your rice, Uncle Roger. I'm Asian. I love it. You're, you're Asian. You love it. I would say that. That's a good spice for people that want to try something. Mm -hmm. Now, I personally don't like spice. I like when it's mild, but I don't like when it's too hot. 
Is that like you? With that, I can handle. I can have a good meal with that spice. Mm -hmm. It's not too strong. It slowly builds up. And you don't taste the spice right away. Mm. I agree. I think yours, you know, yours is like that more nice, sweetie kind of inviting taste. Yeah, uh, I love how it's fried. I love how it's fried. It's not too crunchy. Mm -hmm. And it's not super thick. Like the crunch is thick. Like you, it's only taste the crunch. But it's not the kind of fry that's going to get soggy either. Yeah. Like it's still perfectly crispy after our five minutes of eating. Mm -hmm. No, this place is definitely a, a hidden gem, I'd say. One more? I'm getting full. I am getting full. May I have one more bite of yours? Go for it. Go for it. Okay, I'm gonna have one more of these, one more soup dumpling, and then I'm calling it. Roger, do you want another bite of mine or are you good? I'm good. Should we get dessert? Or I'm stuffed. Do you want dessert? I'm stuffed. One more soup dumpling. We will see you shortly. We'll talk about what we thought of this restaurant. I think we both had a really good time. I'm gonna steal one more piece of his meat, but I will see you soon, Cruisers. Okay, Cruisers, we just finished up at Tea House here in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I thought it was pretty great. It was very, very authentic. The food had a kick to it. Maybe I wish it was a little bit spicier, but Roger, what do you think? I loved it. I love the spice because it was like perfect for me. So the spiciness was great. Great, I'd definitely be coming back here again. This is almost as authentic as you can get. Their menu was vast. They had a, they had some things for people that were not too experimental and the staff were fantastic. But cruisers, I want you to like, comment, subscribe, and I will cruise with you next time. See you later, cruisers. Roger, say it. Say you later, cruisers. Say you later, what? See you later, cruisers. See you later, cruiser. See you later, cruisers. Please subscribe to my channel. It will make me feel really special.